This morning, a historic political comeback. Donald Trump is projected to return to the White House as the 47th president. Yeah, Trump claiming victory with wins in key battleground states. Take a look at the map. Trump's win in Wisconsin putting him over the 270 threshold needed to clinch the presidency. We do expect to hear from Vice President Harris sometime this morning. Eyewitness News reporter Irene Cruz is live in studio with the very latest. Irene. Yeah, John, Rachel, good morning. It really was that win in Wisconsin that changed everything, put him over that 270 uh, threshold needed to take that presidency. It has marked a major comeback for a former president. He has vowed to dramatically reshape federal government. And this morning, Trump spoke about the projected victory, saying he's going to keep his promises to voters. And to every citizen, I will fight for you, for your family and your future. Every single day, I will be fighting for you. And with every breath in my body, I will not rest until we have delivered the strong, safe, and prosperous America that our children deserve and that you deserve. Now, his coarse rhetoric throughout his campaign has really resonated with frustrated and angry voters, and it's been a tumultuous election season, including two assassination attempts on Trump and a shift to a new Democratic nominee just a month before the DNC. Democratic rival Kamala Harris has not spoken this morning about the results, but we did hear from her campaign co-chair. We will continue overnight to fight to make sure that every vote is counted, that every voice has spoken. So you won't hear from the vice president tonight, but you will hear from her tomorrow. Trump is the first former president to return to power since 1892. He is also the first person convicted of a felony to be elected. And at 78 years old, he is the oldest person elected as president. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.